Today we're gonna do some lower body, some glute action. Got her a resistance band. And Jack Jess in the house. Hey guys, Jack Jess here. Today I trained my friend, Shining Cheryl. She's so beautiful and I just want to make her gain some more confidence in herself. She just started working out, which I'm so damn proud of her for. It hasn't even been that long. I remember she just started doing some things around January and now she's doing the Stairmaster for up to an hour. And she says she's not that strong. I think this is a reminder that you have to give yourself credit. Credit for the little things. Credit for all the little mini goals you have achieved. I could really tell in her face, just she's pushing as hard as she can and she's willing to do this for herself. I introduced her to some movements that I went through when I was just starting out because I know the gym can be definitely intimidating. You see all these machines and you're like, what do I do? It's very common for girls to just stick to the cardio because they don't know what to do with the weights. The thing is, the weights are what are gonna sculpt you and that's how you're gonna build the muscle, which <laughs> to burn the fat. She has come a long way. Just looking at her progress pictures, hello, hello, we see progress. So today I took her through a workout. We focused a bit on glutes before we did a lot of supersets and we made it kind of full body and I just gave her a bunch of ideas that you can do some of my favorite exercises for beginners that you are too scared of the machines, you're a bit intimidated. Just here are some go-to exercises that you can do with just the dumbbells. You can add pulsating movements, for example, for most of the exercises, we went to reps of 12. However, if you want to make it more challenging, you can go to reps of 15 and through all the movements, you can add a pulse or a hold every fifth rep. You will be surprised at the difference this makes. It really cranks up the intensity and it really helps you experiment with beginner friendly exercises or exercises that are very simple when you don't have a lot of weights or you're not comfortable using the machines or the heavier barbells yet. So yes, you can hold or pulsate, you can increase the time, just increase the reps, you challenge yourself to slow down the movement, so tempo work, count your way up, count your way down. These are amazing ways to just make exercises more interesting and really focus on that mind to muscle connection. Okay, enjoy the workout, thank you. If you like fitness inspiring content, please drop me a like and subscribe, I would greatly appreciate it. The workout will be posted in the description and the comment section. Peace, Jack Jess out. Hey guys, it's Jack Jess here. So here's my friend, cute Cheryl. I'll come up with a better nickname for you later. She's so cute, she's starting her fitness journey and today we're gonna do some lower body, some like glute action, got her a resistance band and we're gonna like go, okay. So we can first start off with just some walking. We got the booty poppin'! Hello! Guys, she's been doing like Stairmaster for an hour sometimes. So crazy, she's so fit. So, love that. Look, you look so good, she looks so good. Have we, have we seen anyone that looks this good? No. Got this. Usually when I like 
showing someone how to do hip thrust, it's easier to start off with a dumbbell. So having done hip thrust with any weight before. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna try it out. And then I challenge you on the last rep to just hold it for 10 seconds. Ready? 10, 9, squeeze your squeeze your peach. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, yes, we got it. We, we love that extra push. So the next one we're gonna do is dumbbell sumo squat. So you can just grab like whatever weight you don't know with, like stack it up like this. And so the traditional squat is a sumo squat. So your feet are pointed a bit more outwards and then just like that. Yeah. And then this one like definitely targets your glutes. You have to remember to squeeze the top. Okay. We'll go for 12 for this one too. Remember you're squeezing your butt on the peach very you're tight on the top. Like a snatch that peach. Okay, one, two, three, yeah. four. You can! Five, six, come on, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, we got it! Set number two, we crushed. Okay, so how the first set feel? Um, it's very tired. Very tiring, but, but we did it. So for this, I would go for three sets or four sets, depending on how you feel. First, let's take a break. I would recommend just judge how you feel with the break. You can take as little as like 30 seconds. You can go up to two minutes if you need that too. And then for these exercises, to keep the intensity, I would recommend doing a superset. So that means doing two exercises back to back. And we're doing that with sumo squats. Okay, look, guys, she's killing it so far. Hell yeah! So we're gonna start off with the frog pumps. It's kind of similar to the other hip thrust exercises we're doing. So, again, you're just gonna get your back on the bench because it's called a frog. It's kind of like this. And then you gotta jump on the same place and then just squeeze like super hard on the top. Yeah. You know, it's a good thing we're low. You know, this exercise does not get any more awkward than facing someone else and you're just like, okay, hey there. The second one, we're gonna do not like another frog exercise. So you just grab onto the bench right here and then your legs are bent like a frog and then you just thrust it up into the sky like, like this, okay? And then it's gonna really feel like it's in your glutes because Okay, guys, again, it's a good thing we're alone because, you know, these exercises, they look a little questionable, but it, it's okay. Okay, okay, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay. Woo! First set done! We're on to the second set of frog exercises and she's challenging herself to use a 20 pound this time. Super proud of her.
And the last one before this set, I'm going to do some phrases every way. So the first one is well, this. And then just like the next one is like so. We hold for five, four, three, two, one. Okay. Yes. Okay. And guys, we are done. Look at her. She worked so hard. I'm so damn proud. And we're only getting stronger from here. Let's get it. Yes. Oh my god, like look at her. Like she's ah, so proud. Okay, this makes me so happy. Okay, next time. Thank you, Jessica.